so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi, and look at where we're at! Yeah, today we're at the Aquarium of Boise in Boise, Idaho. And this aquarium has a lot of cute animals. Yeah, do you like animals? Yeah, I love animals too. And today you and I can learn about some animals. Let's go. <laughs> oh, and look in here. Whoa, looks like we have some turtles. Oh, hello turtle. Look at it. Whoa, oh, come over here. See this one? Yeah, it's pretty big. But actually, they're gonna get way bigger. Yeah, and these are actually soft shell turtles. You know how most of the time, turtles, their shells are really, really hard? Yeah, these, their shells are soft. Interesting. Did you see how long its neck was? Whoa! Whoa, check it out! A ball python! Whoa, it's so colorful. Yeah, it looks like the color yellow. Yeah, like the sun. Whoa, look at him just hanging out on that log. Hello! <laughs> and did you see its eyes? Yeah, they look reddish. Wow, super cool. <laughs> Snakes are awesome. <laughs> Whoa, and look down here. Whoa, this is a way bigger snake. Whoa, I know what kind of snake this is. This is a Colombian red-tailed boa. Whoa, look at him just hanging out on the soil. Yeah, he kind of looks like the soil color. Yeah, brown and dark brown and black and tan. He does blend in pretty well. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Hey! <laughs> oh, there's someone right here! Oh, hey! Hi. Who are you? I'm Penny. Oh. Who are you? Oh, I'm Blippi. It's nice to meet you, <laughs> Nice Blippi. to meet you. Do you work here? I do work here. Really? What do you do? I'm the lead reptile handler here. Wow, that's really cool. I really like reptiles. Oh, Me too. There's one right here. Wow. This is my friend Sheila. Oh, really? Sheila? Yeah. Whoa, what kind of reptile is she? Sheila is a bearded dragon. Ooh, a bearded dragon? Yeah, I've seen one of those before. Have you ever pet a bearded dragon before? Uh, I don't know. Can I pet it? <gasps> yes, oh. Sheila's super friendly. Okay, all right. Hey, Sheila. Oh. All right. So this is my friend, Sheila. Okay, here we go, just like this? <gasps> yep, just like that, nice and gentle. Wow, <laughs> kind of pokey, but not really. I mean, kind of soft though. Right? Oh. So her scales are kind of pokey, kind of soft. Uh -huh. They're made of the same stuff that makes your fingernails, called keratin. Keratin, cool. Whoa, look at her. Whoa. So you'll notice she has this really cute big beard. <gasps> That's where she gets her name. Oh, bearded dragon. <laughs> that makes sense. And what does she eat? She's an omnivore. So that means she eats a lot of different things. She eats fruits, vegetables, and insects. Oh, wow, cool. And where do they come from? She comes from Australia. Wow, cool. <laughs> wow, what a really cool animal. Well, when was the last time she ate? Ooh, I don't know. She might be hungry. Do you want to try to offer her a snack? Oh, I would love to. Hopefully All right. she's hungry. Follow me. <laughs> All right. All right, here you go, Sheila. Thank Whoa. you. All right. Wow, I'm so curious to see if she's hungry. Wow, okay. what do we have? So today we're gonna be feeding Sheila some mealworms. Oh, check it out, some mealworms. <laughs> Those look yummy, if you are Sheila. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see if she's hungry. All right, I'm oh. gonna give them to you. Oh, okay. There you go. All right, so just put all three right in front of her? You can put all three or you can put them in a line and she will chase after them. There we go. Here you go, mealworm. There the we go. The wiggler, the better. All right, let's see if she's hungry. <laughs> Are you hungry, Sheila? Whoa! So how old is Sheila? Sheila is four. Whoa. And she's really good at sitting still. Well, yeah. I mean, she hasn't moved one bit for a little bit. She's just looking around the environment. Yeah, maybe she, she'll she see the mealworm soon. Whoa, well, we'll cool. see. Whoa, what else is cool about Sheila? So, Sheila loves these bugs. Usually, if we can get her to run for them, that would be wonderful. Yeah. She has a big, fat, sticky tongue that she likes to use to eat those bugs. Is it long or short? It's not very long. It's okay. really short and stubby. It kind of really stays big. in her mouth. Oh, cool. 
Oh. Maybe she's not hungry. Maybe not. Yeah. Sometimes, sometimes that happens. You get food and you're not hungry, huh? Yeah, exactly. And then what are her claws for? Her claws she uses for digging. Oh, digging? Yeah. Oh, what's she digging for? So she would use her claws to dig a burrow for her to live in or for her to lay her eggs. Whoa, that's really cool. Yeah. Whoa. Well, thank you so much for letting us try to feed Sheila. We tried. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All, All right. right. I have another friend that I'd like to show you. Really? I'm going to put Sheila away first, though. So you have fun exploring, okay, Blippi? All right. I'll be back in a bit. Let's keep exploring. <laughs> Whoa, check it out, it's a giant spider. Whoa. This is my friend Raj, she's oh. a tarantula. Oh, hey Raj. Whoa, and this is a tarantula. What kind of tarantula? She is a rose hair tarantula. Rose hair, and where's she from? So she's from South America, from Chile. Oh, cool. She is very big. I'm so used to smite spiders that are really small. She is a lot bigger than house spiders, but she also moves a lot slower, you notice? Yeah, she is moving slower, but she still has eight legs, right? She does, she has eight legs, two spinnerets, Ooh. And then her two helping hands up front. Oh, cool. And does she have really sticky feet? She doesn't. She actually oh. doesn't even have feet. They're called paws. Oh, paws. Yeah. Just like kitties and dogs. Whoa. And her paws are not sticky. Okay. So spiders can walk upside down, but it's because of two special hooks that they have on each foot or paw. Oh, like that this? That helps them to hold on. Mm -hmm. Whoa, look, I'm a spider. Whoa, and does she spin a web? She does. So you'll notice she's using her hooks to hold on right now while I tip her. Wow. Her spinnerets that she uses to spin webs are on the back. Those wow. two little black appendages that look kind of like fingers. Uh-huh. Whoa, and what does she eat? She eats bugs. Bugs? So Lots she likes bugs. crickets and cockroaches. Whoa. Wow, she is so <laughs> cool. And how old is she? Raj is eight years old. Eight? She's an adult female. Wow, that is really old. <laughs> That's not as old as they get, though. Believe it or not, they live to be over 20 years old. Wow, that is old. Whoa. Yeah. Well, that is really cool. And this <laughs> is a really cool spider. Oh, thank you so much for showing me, Raj. And thanks for being so kind to my friend. Yeah, see you later, Raj. <laughs> I'm gonna keep exploring. All right, have fun. See ya. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. A crested gecko. Whoa, they're so cool. And look, yeah, it's just stuck to the side of the glass, just hanging out. Hey, wait a second. A crested gecko. Yeah, that's Mika's favorite reptile. So cool. Hello. <laughs> Whoa, cool. Look, a snake. Oh. He's actually not a snake. He's a legless lizard. Really? This yeah. isn't a snake? No, he kind of looks like a snake, huh? Yeah, he does. He doesn't even have legs. No, oh. no legs. That's why they call it a legless lizard. Whoa, what's he, his name? His name is Tom Riddle. Oh, hello, Tom Riddle. <laughs> I am so, Flippy. He has a couple features that separate him from snakes. Oh, what are they? So the first one is that he has eyelids. He can blink like you and I. Yeah. Snakes don't have eyelids. They yeah. don't blink. Nope, they don't have eyelids. He has these little holes behind his head. Those are actually his ears. Oh. Snakes like don't have those either. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah. What about that line on the bottom? He has that line down his body because his bones are really rigid and he needs it to be able to breathe and swallow his food. Oh, so that expands? Yeah, because he's not as flexible as the snake. Okay. Wow. And then is this his whole body like a snake? So Tom Riddle, being a lizard, his body actually ends right here. Oh yeah. Two thirds of his body are just tail. Whoa, that's crazy. But a snake, their body goes all the way, almost to the very end, right? Yep, that's right, it does. Wow, cool. And what does Tom Riddle like to eat? Tom Riddle likes to eat insects and he'll even eat baby animals. Really? Yeah, like small mice and things like that, but mostly okay. he loves worms and snails. Oh, okay. Where could you find Tom Riddle in the wild? In the wild, you could find him in South and Central Europe. So he'd be in and around Spain and Portugal and parts of Northern Italy. Okay. Wow. He's such a cool animal. May I touch him? You definitely can. Okay. Whoa. He definitely kind of feels like a snake. <laughs> yeah, he does. But his scales are a little more hard and they lay over each other like armor. Not quite as flexible as a snake's scales. Wow. He's 
It's really smooth. Very smooth and glassy, huh? Yeah. So that's, that's another great. name for this guy is a glass lizard. Whoa! Tom Riddle is so cool. Thank you so much for letting me meet another one of your friends. Absolutely. Oh, cool. Whoa! Oh, hello. Check it out. It looks like a chameleon. He is a chameleon. This is my friend Tarzan, and he's a panther chameleon. Oh, hey, Tarzan. Whoa, panther chameleon. Whoa, and he's very bright green. Does he change colors? He is bright green right now. He does change colors. Wow. So chameleons change colors to communicate with each other. Oh, that's really cool. So they change colors to let others say chameleons know something? Yes, or other animals, like a big scary predator. They may turn black and red to say, I'm scary, don't mess with me. Oh, cool. Ooh, and he loves to crawl, huh? Looks like he grabs onto you with his weird looking hands. He does. Do you want to see what that feels like? Sure. All right, he's okay. very delicate, so be okay. careful. Okay. Oh, hey, Tarzan. Hey, how are you? Whoa, check it out. I'm holding a chameleon. Whoa. So as he's walking, you'll notice on his feet, he has five toes, just like we do. Yeah. But they're split, three and two. Okay. That's yeah. how he holds on to your fingers and to the vines in the canopy. Whoa, that's really cool. It looks like his eyes are pointing different directions? They do, yeah. So that's a special kind of vision called stereoscopic vision. And that means he has two independent visual fields. Whoa, so he can see that way and that way all at the same time? All at the same time. Whoa, cool. Look at his tail, it looks all curly, why is that? His tail is super curly and it has another special name. It's called a prehensile tail. Whoa. He uses it like a safety line for holding on. Okay, whoa, so he can like wrap it around a tree branch and hold on? Exactly, and that comes in handy when he's trying to eat and he has to use a secret weapon in order to catch his bugs. Really? Okay, so he loves to eat bugs? He does. What's the secret weapon? His secret weapon is a long, sticky tongue. Oh, cool. Do you think he's hungry? He might be. Let's find out. All right, Tarzan. Flippy, did you know hungry. that a chameleon's tongue is as long as its body? Really? Yeah. I didn't know that. That's really his long. His tongue is really long. Whoa. All right, let's see if he's hungry. Let's see, Tarzan is a little older, so his eyes are not as good as they used to be. Okay. So once he sees the bug, we'll see if we can get him to take it. Yeah. Whoa, that was awesome. Isn't that exciting? Yeah, it is a long sticky tongue. Super long and sticky. Wow, was that yummy, Tarzan? Wow, yeah, that was so cool. And speaking of cool, all of your animal friends are so cool. Thank you so much for letting me meet them. Thank you for coming to say hi today and helping me feed some of the animals. Yeah, no problem. My pleasure. Here you go. All right, I will take back. my buddy. All right, see you later, Tarzan. Bye-bye. <laughs> Thank you so much. It was fun. Thank you so much for coming to visit us, Lippy. Yeah, no problem. See you see later. See you later. <laughs> Wow, this has been so much fun. I sure do love animals. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa, look up there! Yeah, it looks like a green iguana. Wow, green iguanas are so cool. Yeah, they're the color green. <laughs> Ooh, and look, doesn't it look really long? Yeah, this one isn't even full-sized yet. Yeah, when they get full-sized, they are up to seven feet long. Whoa, that's over two meters long. Basically, if I was to lay down next to a full-size green iguana, they would be longer than me. Whoa, that is so cool. Ooh, and this one's name is Azul. Huh, that's interesting. That means blue in Spanish. <laughs> they could have named him Verde because that means green in Spanish. Well, still, Azul is a cool name. See you later, Azul. Wow, did you have fun today? Yeah, learning about all these reptiles. Wow, I sure did have a lot of fun with you. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, though. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah. B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi. Good job. See you again. Bye-bye. <laughs> Come on everyone, 
Let's make learning fun. Blippi, blippi, blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you wanna shout. Blippi. Blippi.